हेलो गाइस वेलकम टू माय चैनल वेलकम बैक एट नेक्स्ट रेस्टफुल एपी ट्यूटोरियल इन दिस ट्यूटोरियल वी आर गोइंग टू यूज राउटर मॉड्यूल आउटर ऑब्जेक्ट वो क्रिएटिंग ए रूट्स बिकॉज रूट्स आर वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट फॉर मेकिंग रेस्टफुल एपीआईज for making a query to the server from the client side so as well as for router we are going to implement a mvc architecture also so let's we start for mvc architecture <coughs> for making a mvc architecture we have to create a new folder is called route your routes so in this folder we have to create a new file for making a request in this restful api i want to make a request from the client side for getting information about the students so like i want to create a new file here is called students.js okay this student.js file having a roots or the urls from the browsers we can give the server side from the client machine so we are going to make here so this route is work is this route directory is we are using here for mvc means we are creating a models here in this student.js file and we will link this file to app.js okay this app.js is work as a controller in mvc we have a controller view and architect view and model so model view controller so model we are creating here in student.js controller we also have and view will will also display the data on monitor by using <coughs> some commands later on we will see also views so here in student we are going to create a routes for that again we have to create a express object and we require the express module okay and then we require the router module so we say route router and we say require uh, express because it's not a module is object router okay so we are creating a object of router here we have to make a routes uh, like this router dot get i will use the get request also here okay so in this get request i will call a function callback function which having a request and response two objects like this okay so in a get request i will give you this response here to the server send and uh, here i will use the object also okay like this uh, name uh, for example we say method okay or we say get and because the object so we have to close it like this okay so this is a one route clear we want to implement four routes get for getting information from the server and put here post post for inserting a data so we replace it by the post again we copy paste and change it to put put for updating your information okay what means you want to update your records through url last one is delete by the name you can also analyze delete means deleting a record okay like this then in delete actually we have to implement id we will discuss later on but right now we are doing this routes we are creating four routes here and then we are passing a routes 
module dot expert modules dot exports sorry module dot exports then router okay what we are doing uh, we are creating a here the object of router this one and we are creating a four routes get routes for getting information from the server and we are displaying information get in a json format this is not actual json we will change it to json also but we are giving a information object format because in restful api we always having output in a json format so we are having a here route another route is post post means for inserting a new records put means for updating a records and lit means for recording a for deleting a records and here we are passing these routes to the outer module where we will call we are calling this here in app.js so what we are doing we have to import again here so we are saying app we can say student because it is a student file and uh, we say require okay where we require we are in here so we require in route folder we say it is in route folder route stick okay and we have the student no need to give the file name okay so where app app.js is here on the same directory we have a folder routes so we are giving here dot means current directory routes and the name student dot js no need to put js and js is understood automatically student okay now we have to use it so what we have to use we have to use that app dot use and here we have to give the root we say student okay and i have to give here a student done when i save it my node one automatically restart my server and i go to this machine if i say restful express okay is running in express but i have been given another url also is called student okay you see method get a student okay means what is the mean of this student we have given here uh, the routes you see a student okay so under the student what we have we have the root root means under student we have a get post put and delete from browser i can all, only show the get method but i can't show you post method so i will use the postman tool in next tutorial in which i will send all these requests and i will show you the output from that and if i say for example if i say here a student okay student get and here i say student and i save so it will restart automatically and go here if i refresh it it won't say anything because now a student is under student and if i say this this is get request so if we are giving a student here the outside no need to give student here okay okay we are giving in the outside here that means all the routes under this student routes this one it will display all four routes okay all get post put delete everything will be display under this student so whenever i use this query now it won't it would not run because it's not available available is what we have only student and root so now again we have get so here i can't give you post request because post is not possible from browser for fetching all these request i will give you example of postman tool you have to install the postman i will give you the instruction how can you install postman and how to use postman in next lecture i will give you in a demo of using postman tool and how we how we can use all these requests because in restful api we don't need browser we need a client machine from the client machine we give all these types of request so uh, slowly slowly day by day in, in future lectures i will explain you each and every concept of restful api for that 
we have to wait for next lecture also okay